Do you have anything particular you wanted to discuss? Is this your first time? Yeah, it's my first time. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. How do you find the open air asylum at the moment? <laughs> that really is. No, no, I've been there over the years. You know, what I mean? I'm a Londoner, but I haven't been there for a long time. Still, okay. You know what I mean? so, and was it more political when you come before, or was it already? It's similar, same, but yeah, it seems to have a more of a religious edge. At the moment. You noticed? <laughs> yeah, yeah just ever so slightly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what is, did you come to speak or just mainly yeah, to listen? Mainly, I was going to speak, I'm checking it out and willing to speak. Nice, yeah, yeah. and what's your like chosen topic on Mastermind as it were? Well, I'm just spreading the word of Morpheus, the wisest man on the planet's here. That's You're spreading your own word? Yeah, of Morpheus, the wisest man on the planet's here. I reckon, well, potentially profits all start off small, but what is your? what are your wise words for us? Um, Anything like are you advancing anything on Jesus's wisdom or you're kind of sticking in the objective morality kind of paradigm like what are you saying it's an amalgamation of the best of them Do you oh. find any best in Islam? Good answer. Well done the man's not a liar. <laughs> that's it. I think that's a no. All prophets so all Yeah, but he ain't a prophet. Scholars, all Nah, he ain't a scholar. Well, an illiterate Bedouin can't really be called a scholar. And the Bible says that anyone who comes with a gospel other than this one, or a Jesus other than this one, uh, is to be accursed. And Jesus himself says, this is the law and the prophets up to John. And from that time on, like that's done. And now the kingdom is being preached. So there are no more prophets as in Islam. It's a I false find it amazing um, the belief system of man and mankind and the whole Jesus thing and you know we, 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 we've got selective memory and cognitive dissonance and stuff like that. It's just it's amazing. But then, why do you want to put down Muslim and play up Christianity? It's I tell you why. The most I tell you why. Things in Jesus' name. It doesn't matter whether they did it in Jesus' name, name, but no, if they, no, no, let me answer under you. The religion, well, let me, let me under the religion, uh -huh. talk a lot. I'm just well, I'm, well, I'm going to counter yeah, that yeah. because if they're quoting the Bible, then that's wrong. But if they're just saying they're Christians and coming with some madness, that's not my bag to defend it. You see what I'm saying? Roman Catholic. I'm not a Roman Catholic. No, I'm just saying the Roman Catholics, whatever church denomination. Yeah, but whatever. are they using the Bible yeah. to justify it? Yeah. Like what? Roman Catholics, I'm talking about what? what paedophilia? In what? Oh, okay. Yeah, but, yeah, paedophilia, yeah, that's a nice one to go Yeah, but they're not the going world. from the Bible, is my yeah, point. The church people, they're Whereas, your people, they're your representative. You can't pick and choose selective and all that. You can. Which domination, the denomination that you're talking about. No, you can. If you go no, by right. the Bible, you can. silliness and ridiculousness with all religions. Okay, and now I'm going to counter all of that. No. If you can and, use and your... I'm not, I'm not necessarily want to come to sort of like... Defend Islam. Yeah, you sound a bit like it. Defending Islam. You did. You said, why are you here to put down Islam? As an example, because you be stuck yeah, on yeah, that. Yeah. It's not just Islam. I, I Let me put it to you all, plainly. All religions got something, and Excellent. all religions got some ridiculousness as well. Yeah, I'm the, I, I, know, I don't say that all reli no religions are without a grain of truth in them. Obviously, if anything Jesus says feed the poor. Hippie? No. What is he? Do what do you mean, what is he? He is my God. No, I'm going to counter your point. Is he black? I have no idea. So I So I care about... Yes, I care about the colour of his uh, blood, not his skin. So, and, and the Bible says neither Jew nor Gentile, so he cared Why little bit either. Over the place? It's stupid, stupid but it's, can I, Right, well, let me, finish, let me yeah, counter your two good. points yeah. now. In Japan, Jesus is Japanese, you'll be amazed to hear. In some African countries, he's a black uh, Jesus. So it's not about the externals, it really yeah, ain't. But what, it's about the, the inner man. Sort of like what, you mean in, in white Western societies? All well, it would the be world. white then, all wouldn't it? The world. It doesn't matter to me. Ethiopia. That's not the Bible. No, no, I'm asking you not to you in general. Well, I just answered you. No, no, it's no, irrelevant it to me. To you. What is it? You just answered. What is it? It's not people... stop. You just talk, talk well, I'm about trying Japan. to answer your Islam well, you thing. Speaking about Japan with the color because you started asking me what color is Jesus. In Japan, it's Japanese. The majority of time. In time. Majority of time, what color is it? Depends whether you live in Japan or not. No, majority of the time in most parts of the world, what colour is it? In the most white parts, it will be white. And in the most Japanese and Chinese and no, Asian... It's not like that. It's not it like is that. like that. It's not like that. Anyway, it's that's not. irrelevant to my doctrine. It doesn't say so in the Bible. The Bible is clear that his appearance was of no surprise. Let me finish my point. It was of no uh, noteworthy... It wasn't, uh, it wasn't like they were going, oh my God, look at that purple geezer walking along. No one cared enough because he must have blended in. Because he was of the tribe white, he was of 
the tribes. He was an what Israelite. Tribe? Oh, the tribe of Israel. Judah. Judah. So, the, but he was an Israelite. So now back to the Quran and the paedophilia and the Catholicism. I will answer it. I'll just do it to the camera. So the point is, because I'm tired and I was about to have a cigarette. So the point is that if you can justify paedophilia from your holy scripture, not you personally, anyone, I'm going to go out well, on a limb. That's what Islam is. That's yes, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that but, is but from Satan. But the bloody Christians have got the most paedophiles and all that in them, though. How do we know so that paedophiles the, haven't the infiltrated church, the church? church and all that. So, so schools have a lot. I will. I your, will. But, but your priest, Don't try and come no, here no, no, and no, tell no, my no, free no, speech. No, 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 but the priest, no, but the priest, no, no, I'm not telling you that. But so the how priest, do we know? The priest do Great. significant. I hear that. You don't hear that. I hear that. And you do hear that. Are you talking about grooming gangs? You must be. You surely think the imam's job is to go and sleep with a woman. And if she wants to get divorced so she can go back to the man you don't i don't think you'd really like grasp the context my point is schools hospitals places where there are vulnerable people attract paedophiles into their ranks doesn't mean that the person's a born teacher or a real life priest if you see what i'm saying if you're a nonce you want to work in a nursery if you're a paedophile you might want to go and work in a children's hospital you might want to be jimmy savile you might want to work in an industry where you've got power and they're subjugated and therefore the catholic church i can well believe has been infiltrated by paedophiles to some extent because they will not find it in the scripture and therefore they are not of me whereas catholics are of me because they are in christ with me is jesus real Yes. What's the proof? The, the, the cloth of Torah? Flavius, no, Flavius Josephus, Tacitus. They are historians, Jewish historians who had no reason to lie. The Roman transcripts of no the crucifixion. Yes, no reason to lie because they were Jews. They didn't really like Jesus. That's it. I've got extra. I'm going to make a video. I'm going to give you my link because I promised them earlier. I'm going to make a video proving the existence of Jesus without any Bible whatsoever because there are Roman transcripts of uh, conversations between governors. There's the actual uh, pilot is referenced as the one who so condemned him. going on that road. So he's, he's, it's real that his mum got pregnant by the Holy Spirit. He, so now we're changing it. He really existed. Yes. Pardon? He no, really no, existed. My, my, my question, I just asked you about the pregnancy. I you believe know? that, yes. Right, right, you believe Well, that. there were no so hospitals were at the water. time. I believe that, yes. Wait, no, what hospitals? There were no hospital records to go by in uh, Bethlehem. So what do you mean? In, in regards to what? In the in, the uh, miraculous birth. The angel, you asked me, did that happen? I'm saying, yeah, but I can't go to his... Oh, I don't know if I can, actually. Maybe. Maybe uh, Josephus spoke about a miraculous nature. Yeah, and so did Pilate, I think. Yeah, those, those, those deeds um, were recorded. Yeah, some of them. You know, you know the funny thing is, but right, we should, we, we, in some respects, I don't want to battle you like this because it should be of the same sort of. But if you're the wisest man in the world, I'm going to go ahead and call it that. Nah, if you're not in down with Jesus, even, even the godless, even Muslims, even Buddhists, I never hear anyone say that Jesus. What a wrong one. Never. They say he's a great moral teacher. That's he's just, not God, but he's a good so guy. So what does Jesus sort of like want us to do? And he wants us to love our, love our, these are his two commandments. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul and strength and love your neighbours as yourself. And he says, and in these, and in that, love your neighbour as yourself. That encompasses the entirety of the old law, all 613 laws, ordinance and commandments. And it, love covers a multitude of sins. So if you do this for him, that's what he wants you to do. That's it, love is what he wants you to do and that's where the hippie thing comes along but it doesn't mean love as in like or approve because if my child becomes a murderer i still means, love him it means like love as in what then it means love as in rebuke if you've got a child I don't, I don't need to know your personal business but i have got a child and if if she turned come to me and said uh, she's murdered someone i don't stop loving her but i, I wanted to do well, i don't know about the right thing but i want to help her i don't really care at that moment in time about the victim because i don't know them I love so my daughter. Rebuke. You're going to rebuke yes, daughter. yes, of course. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'm right. going to tell her. Don't put your fingers that. in the plug socket. Don't uh, blaspheme. Right. Don't uh, whatever is harmful to her in the long run. I don't want her to do it, but I'm going to do it with love. I'm going to do it because I love her. Who else do you appreciate in the world? Like, what you like, mean, like, historical like, figures? Yeah, or normal people. Who else do you appreciate? Because I don't understand the. My the, friends, um, my. And you got no other heroes like Oprah Winfrey or anything like that. Uh, well, I'm not really into like grooming and, and oh, satanic stuff, oh, but yeah, um, yeah. Oh, well, okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah, so no, nothing like to yeah, nothing yeah, to do yeah, with yeah, um, like mainstream or Hollywood. No, yeah. I, okay. So at the moment, 
or I don't know about currently, but maybe the women of the suffragette movement. I've got a lot of, you know, the one who, uh, Emmeline Pankhurst, the one who chained herself to the railings for them. They went to Holloway, they got uh, false fed, they went on starvation. So the other women in the future could have equality. So I appreciate that, even though I'm not a left winger. Like, I don't mean equal outcome, I mean equal opportunity. Are you a feminist? No, I'm a Christian. Yeah, but you might be a Christian feminist. So no, I don't need to be because God has already so told you Jesus. Pancreas, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, no. But I appreciate that in the society that she was in, women didn't get a fair crack at a whip. Now it's so good to be a woman that even men are trying to get in on the act, saying their name's Susan, and everyone has to tiptoe round them and say they look pretty when they're blatantly got testicles on show while they're telling little kids stories in libraries. So Jesus ain't a problem in this scenario. It's a lack of. Objective morality is a lack of this is wrong and don't be afraid Can to say so. Can you be loving and wise and caring without Jesus? No, I can't. I'm, no, I'm no, not a nice not, person. No, take it so I've tried. No, I don't be believe be anyone be can. No. No. no, but with the Bible, right. my religion, yeah. my yeah. faith but, teaches but, me. I'm going to answer you why. You said no, but yeah. The fruits of the spirit. Why, the no, fruits no. of the spirit are peace, patience, kindness, love, mercy, goodness, something, something. <laughs> not, not memory. <laughs> but. Without those things, the Bible says that there is not one good. Not one. And you know that in your own heart. I know I'm not a good person. I know it. But the Bible seems to, the religion also creates the, the, the worst kinds of people as well. They're zealots, so I can't answer for them. They're not of me. That's amazing. You think that you Jesus can't never commanded anyone to kill. So anyone who's killing and saying it's down to Jesus, they're lost. You think that you, 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 you can't be a good person without knowing or... Well, Jesus is pretty... Jesus. Well, Jesus is the Logos and he, the Bible, attests to that and it's God breathed. And I know in my heart of hearts that without Christ, I ain't got no patience for no one. I don't care what they think. I'll, I'll, I'll just sit there and think, yeah, why don't you die? You know what I mean? Like I have no decent thoughts going on because I'm... A Basically, like I am. That's, that's probably you and your issues. Well, no, I've never yet. I've never met one single person who does an attribute. Yeah, I, I, I can't remember off the moment at the moment still. I mean, otherwise, what drives the, the, the same people? You're condemning people for murdering in the name of religion, but that alludes to an objective morality outside yourself because you might think that there is a good reason to kill someone. You might say if someone's caught noncing or if someone's caught stabbing a pregnant woman to death, they deserve it. You might say that. But objectively, we have to be measured by an outside standard. Otherwise, I can just say, well, it's Wednesday. To me, that means I can but kill a homeless look, person. If you look at the world and everything, does, does it look like God actually giving a about anything? Yes. No, no, where do you see that? In my own life, my no, own testimony. No, okay. no, but beyond that, like... The testimony, general, me, the like, testimony like, like, of the other people. And all that, and yep. and I see. I see the suffering because I preach, or I, I teach, I publicise regularly the, the genocide of Nigerians, for example, the Christians. There's an actual genocide going on. Tens of thousands in the last 10 years, wait up, of being killed for, for confessing Jesus. That's their only crime. So all this Black Lives Matter nonsense, these black people don't matter at all one bit, not even to the people who make out they matter. And I see that that is in the name of a religion and, it, and in, this, in the scripture that's being used to kill those people, it says fight those who don't believe. But in my scripture it says pray for those who curse you, bless those who hate you, pray for your persecutors. So I don't see anything in my religion of this. I'll tell you where I am with all of this. Right? Go on. Religion's, religion's done its thing, it's helped out to some degree. It's pretty, it's, 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 some degree, we it stopped helps, infanticide helps, in Rome. It helps balance out the human personality. Sure. These guys there, I'm worried about they're, they're clocking me still. Well, you're, <laughs> you're being a black man without due care and attention, so you better watch yourself. Um, anyway, yeah, so... Um, you think it's had its day and it's all done now. What would you replace it with though? What about this left-wing well, nonsense? We, we have to wonder, is it, is it cause more problems than... If it has, it's not the religion. You see what I'm saying? Like eugenics, yeah? You know the idea of you can uh, modify humans and kill off uh, like black babies, like the woman who done Planned Parenthood. The point is that that science in and of itself is not evil. It's the heart of man that is wicked. So I can get something that is you know, some cure for cancer, and I can turn it into crack summit. Do you know what I mean? Like, science can be used to benefit or to, de like, detriment. You can hop, skip and jump around everything. That ain't hopping and skipping. Science is amoral. 
you can choose something that kills babies or you can choose something that cures them of cancer. So I'm saying it's the human always who is at fault, not the religion, not the science, the human interpretation well, of it. you say the Ku Klux Klan and stuff use the Bible, everybody uses the Bible. They might try, but I'd like to see them try with me. Have you heard that before? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, good, good, good. I'm glad yeah. you're honest. But once they, that book is told, yeah, the Yeah, the one who says God hates fags. Southern Baptist, uh, yeah. whatever they are, them nutters. They can say it, but there's people walking about in the psychiatric hospital saying they're uh, like Francis of Assisi. Jesus, they're not. This has come out of a ridiculous statement about Mary Magdalene and ejaculation. I didn't come out with it. I didn't come out with a statement. Yes, you did come this out is what the earliest writing. Christian writings wrote. What did you just say? The earliest Christian. Anyway. Okay, here we go. The earliest Christians. You're on camera, by the way. I don't care. The Did I say you cared? Epiphanes of Salamis. What? The earliest Christians are what? Bro, I will read clearly. Alright, bye then. See you later, love. Right. Yeah, bye, bye, bye. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, bye, bye. bye, bye. bye, bye, bye. I don't understand what you're saying. Take less. Excellent. Bye now. Alright, see you later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God bless you. Anyway. The geese, no, I don't want that on camera. The geezer's talking filth. The earliest Christians were the disciples. Go away. You just approached me, you nutter. You nutter. What a loon. I don't care. He's a nutter. I don't mind what religion he is. I don't mind. If you want to find me uh, more, uh, I haven't put it up um, stuff yet, but it's going to be at more for us. More for us. M O R E number four no, US. No, no, P no. More, F-O-R-U-S. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, yeah. Dot com or on YouTube? Um, Instagram, everything, Twitter. Okay, we're that. All right, well, this is Soko Films, and I'm K Soko Films. I just spelled the Soko against S-O. Soldiers of Christ Online. It's an acronym, S-O-C-O. -O. If you put in S-O-C-O-F, the first one that comes up is Soko Films, I think. All right, anyway, I'm going to do a wrap-up. So we've got lunatic number one over this one, talking about semen, and I don't even know what, telling me, like, da, 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 when he approached me, telling me move away, because it's obviously medication time and no one has got to him yet. And then this gentleman was very nice. That's all right, don't worry. And then this, um, this guy came, uh, came along. Morpheus, I'm so sorry, Morpheus. I love that film. Um, yeah, yeah, I know. I'm waiting on my red pill and my blue pill. Anyway, Lawrence Fishburne over here. No, I'm joking. So anyway, that was an all right conversation. Pretty like, um, uh, what's the word? Oh, like grounded in beliefs that are not really able to be tested without kind of, I don't know, it's, it's good. This is one of his first few times here. So I appreciated that. And yeah, I'm going to wrap it up and then uh, maybe hear more about semen and Jesus, apparently, which is disgusting. No, this, some nut nut, I don't know. Anyway, Charles is obviously so camera shy, it's embarrassing for him. He loves it like you wouldn't believe. I'm trying to, but I'm getting like fielded. Now this guy, I, let me just wrap up. Okay, God bless. See you later. Bye-bye.